morning children this is indraja as you know i am english teacher now i am going to teach you the first lesson of english nouns and verbs okay today i am going to talk the nouns the what are the nouns as we have already introduced in the second class the nouns is nothing but is the naming words as we all know all the naming words you know no like our name then rivers names places names and persons names things name what are things have which is has its own name no you know no that yeah nouns nouns is nothing but the naming word and another thing is that the verb verb is nothing but is the action action of the person or a things that is happening when we shows the verbs so the first i'm going to read out the poem so the first poem is a nouns and verbs of all things i know and love like the earth below and the sky above the wind in the trees and the waves of the sea all this the nouns will name for me so in this above passage they are talking about the nouns and also verbs so can you identify the nouns in this first paragraph so let me write the first and you will mark the nouns
it's not a uh, dog. It looks like a dog. It will have the long tail and also buck. Buck means nothing. It's a deer. Deer you all might have seen. The small deer and big deer you might have seen. All these are called the name things. And the third standard of all the things that have deeds are done. I can leap on the rope or run. I can sweep softly, cheers or suckle with glee. All these doing words decrease. So the first two standards are described about the nouns. The third standard is going to describe about the verbs. Already I have mentioned you that verb is an action word. What we have to do that. Uh, Action will be done for us. So here see, leap, linger, rope, run. All these are the habitual actions we will do. Sometimes we will run, sometimes we will jump, sometimes we will be skipping, sometimes we will be laughing, sometimes we will be crying. All these are what? These are all the actions of ours. So I leap, I learn, I wish for, I work. But it is a good day, I could. Lazily shut. Then a charm I can say the good to fulfill. I can I should I want to be. So this passes mostly talking about all our nouns and the verbs. Previously we have studied. So here you see the over the picture. In this picture you see the boy is uh, one boy is running, another boy is standing. Another one is limping, another one is looking. Here you see the dolphin picture is showing. And so fishes are there, and here fox also is there. All these animals you may have not seen really, but in this picture they have given. Here cow also they have given here. So can you see and make it out? Uh, 